some of the tools that are found in our toolbar. And the toolbar is found here under the triangle, and it's also found at the other side of the board here. So it's always accessible to you, even when you're using another device such as a computer or an iPad. Down here are the tools, and so you'll see a hammer and a wrench. And that will bring out four icons. In this video, we're only going to focus on the first three. The last one, called Air Class, there will be a separate video. Let's look at the spotlight. The spotlight will focus your audience on something on the screen. So here's our circle here of focus. And to move it, I'm going to stand away from it so that everybody can focus on that, not on my hands. And I can move this around just by dragging in the black area here. I can make it bigger by stretching in the center or pinching. And there's a cogwheel here that allows you to scale it from this as well. So I can make it smaller or bigger. Now the alpha that's seen here means that you can change how bright the background is compared to the spotlight. So I can reveal more of the background, or I can completely black it out. And to close it, we press the X. The next one on that menu, and the tools, is the countdown. So if you want to perhaps give students time for a test and let them know how much time they have left, or you have a business meeting and you say, we have one hour for this meeting, you can set the countdown. So if they have one hour, we'll scroll here to make it one and scroll down. So there's an hour, hour, minutes, seconds. Just to show you how this works, I'm going to give us three seconds. And right here it says ring when time is up. So if you want an oral clue, you can do that as well by leaving the check mark here. Let's start. And it's going to count down. And there you go, you can hear the bell. We can also make this as big as the screen so that everybody can see that. I'm going to reset it. And to close it, we press the X. All right, let's go back and look at the stopwatch, which is here. And this is just used by pressing start, and it keeps the time that's uh, elapsed. And we can press left, and it'll keep a record at 5. 0.02 seconds and lap. And as you press that, it'll just keep record of when the laps have occurred. That's it. We'll press the X. And those are the first three icons on the tool menu here. And to see all about Air Class, check out our video called Air Class. Thank you for watching. I hope that was helpful.